Hey guys, Ben Holdred here with Surveyor. I'm coming to you from the Forest River studio. Today we're gonna do a tour of the 240 BHLE. This is a dual axle floor plan, part of our Legend series, one of my favorite floor plans. It's got some incredible features. Excited to get into it with you. This floor plan is right above 5,000 pounds, about 5,200 pounds it's sitting here today, and right above uh, 27 feet. So great versatile size floor plan, take it anywhere. Again, national parks, you're right in that, that sweet spot for getting off the grid and going wherever you wanna go. So keep that in mind. But this has some great features. Let's get into some of the features we've got up front, the storage area, and then on the door side, we've got some great stuff going on. Let's check it out. You can see we've got the nice front end of the Legend series here, automotive style front window. You've got the Legend graphics, uh, one of my favorite graphic setups here in the Legend series. You've got a dual propane setup here. Anytime you have a dual axle floor plane, you're gonna get the, uh, the dual propane setup with the cover, keep that in mind. Standard power tongue jack you're gonna see on every single model. Manual override up here as well if you lose power. What's really nice about this, you have the hitch light uh, and the electric switches here, so very easy to put it up and down, but also hitch up at night, early in the morning. You've got a cord on the other, uh, or excuse me, a holder for your seven-way cord, which is really nice. Get it off the ground, out of the snow, mud, and then you've got a battery disconnect that's gonna be standard equipment on every single model, as well as you're gonna see the, uh, the new repeater, uh, red light up here for our TPMS system. You're gonna see this on every single model. This is a brand new feature for 2023. We are excited about gonna keep you safe as you're, as you're traveling down the road, give you a lot of peace of mind. It's gonna monitor not only tire pressure, but heat, as well as uh, give you some alarms for fast leaks, slow leaks. So give you a lot of peace of mind as you're traveling down the road. Again, help you get off the road safely before you have an issue. Let's check out this front storage area here. Full pass through here in the 240BH, huge area. You've got slam latch baggage doors. You've got a magnetic door catch here, making it very easy to access this storage area. A couple great features you've got in addition to that. Motion lighting up here in the pass-through area, something you're gonna see across the board on our stuff. And also a three quarter inch drill bit that's gonna assist with these manual jacks. You've also got aluminum bed bases here. So just some additional uh, structural integrity there in the bedroom, but just a beautiful, nice, clean pass-through area here. Tons of room for any additional equipment you wanna take with you. This is a bunkhouse, so uh, odds are you're gonna have a lot of stuff with you. So a, a really nice storage area to put the stuff that you don't wanna put inside. Let's check out this big awning here. You've got a full size awning here, stretches almost the entire length of the unit. You've got an LED light strip here as well, but this is gonna cover your entry door, cover your outside kitchen area, which I'll show you here shortly, but a really nice uh, electric awning set up here. One of my favorite features, on the exterior here, the brand new black glass 26 inch entry door. It's got a window cut out here, as you can see. It's also got shade prep, you can add aftermarket. Really beautiful setup. It's on a friction hinge, which is really nice. Again, this is a bunkhouse, so you're probably gonna have kids running in and out. Really nice safety feature here. You're not gonna damage the side of your unit, nor do, uh, no door latches needed there. Friction hinge is gonna hold up to some nice gusts of wind, but really good looking door, very functional as well. A Moride step here, you're gonna have the Moride step, that's standard equipment on every single model, but you see it here in this 240. A lot of great features here on this Moride step. One of my favorites is we've got the surveyor name cutout, that's backlit. Anytime you turn that porch light on, it's gonna illuminate those steps. So a nice safety feature if you have kids or pets. Um, a couple more things here, aluminum wheels. You've got standard equipment. You're gonna see the dust covers there uh, that have the TPMS signal uh, symbol on them. Uh, but aluminum wheels on every single floor plan that we offer. Uh, before we head to the back, I wanna talk about one more thing. We've got a sealed and heated underbelly on this floor plan, every single model that we build. And again, we've got a full lineup of half ton, true half ton towable trailers. And uh, you're gonna have a sealed and heated underbelly on every single model. So you're protected with the sealed underbelly, but you've got a dedicated heat duct that forces air to the underbelly, uh, keeping it uh, warm when you're running that furnace. So let's head to the back. I wanna show you uh, the outside kitchen, some other great features. All right, we're in the back of the 240 BHLE. This is your outside kitchen setup that you're gonna get here. Full outside kitchen, really nice setup, compact still, but everything you need here. You've got a mini fridge, you've got a nice storage area here, and then you've got your pullouts here. So you're gonna have a dump sink that goes here 
freshwater access, freshwater spray port there. This is where your Suburban Elite Series griddle is going to go. And then you're going to have a nice pull-out tray as well if you want to set condiments or anything you want to do there. So a really nice outside kitchen set up here on the 240BH. But keep in mind, you've got an outside kitchen standard on every single Surveyor floor plan in our Legend in our Grand Series. Let's head to the back. I'll show you some more standard features. All right, guys, we're in the back of the 240BHLE, uh, one of my favorite rear setups here. We'll get into some of the features. Uh, let's talk about some of the standard equipment we've got here. Standard roof ladder, built to walk on roof. You got 16 on center trusses, PVC roof membrane up there, uh, best material on the market. So a really nice roof set up there, fully walkable roof. You don't see that a lot in the lightweight segment. We've got our rear storage door here. This is on a friction hinge, very cool setup. Makes it very easy to load a full-size kayak, bikes, whatever you wanna put under that flip-up bunk, which I'll show you on the inside. But what's really nice about this setup, it sets up just high enough where you can put the fold-down cargo rack on, which most setups, uh, most competitors that have this setup, you can't do that. So we give you the ability to put that additional storage rack on there to take some additional items with you, firewood, coolers, generators, strap some more bikes down, whatever you wanna do. So very cool setup, very versatile. Standard spare tire cover as well, standard backup camera prep, uh, but just a great rear setup here in the 240, one of my favorites, like I said. Uh, let's head inside, some great interior features to show you. All right, guys, we're inside the 240 BHLE, one of my favorite floor plans, hands down, double over double bunks, really nice size though, like I said, just over 27 feet and right over 5,000 pounds, so very versatile in size, you can take it anywhere, national parks, go off the grid, really that sweet spot uh, to be able to take it anywhere, mid-sized vehicle can tow it, certainly half ton towable as well. Ton of space in here, it does not feel like an under 30 foot unit, Tall slide out boxes, tall ceilings. You've got 82 inch uh, interior height here, flat ceilings all the way across. So 82 inches all the way across, just a ton of space. Six foot tall slide outs, very comfortable to step in that dinette. We'll, sh uh, we'll show you that here shortly. You've got a 15K AC, that's standard equipment. Um, all of our legend floor plans, all of our grands are gonna have this 15K air standard equipment. So keep that in mind. That's not something you're gonna see a lot in the lightweight segment. A lot of times you gotta uh, upgrade that from a 13.5, so keep that in mind. Let's check out this bunk area, this 240. Very cool, very unique setup here. Double over double bunks. You do have the removable ladder as well, which is really nice. If you wanna uh, keep it down in transit, you can do that. Uh, very sturdy here, but if you wanna throw it in the bunk area, you can do that too, or underneath, a lot of storage back here. But double over double bunks, oversized bunks, just a huge sleeping area here. You've got windows, top and bottom, letting a lot of natural light in. Kids can look out, see the campsite. You've got uh, lights and USB, top and bottom bunks. What's nice about the lights, you can push, they're push buttons, you can turn them off and on. If uh, one of the kids wants to stay up, one wants to go to sleep, very easy to do that. Then you've got the nice privacy curtains here as well if they want some privacy. You've got your storage door, which we talked about in the back. Very cool setup. Again, you can get the fold down cargo rack still on the back, which is very cool, but this will fit a full size kayak. You can put bikes in here, but any additional items you wanna take with you, this is just a great additional storage area here. The bottom bunk flips up. You also have the magnet here, which is gonna keep that, uh, that flip down bunk down um, and sturdy uh, when you're in transit. So keep that in mind but a very cool setup here in the 240 BHLE. Let's check out this bathroom. Even with the ladder down, you can still open the bathroom door, which is really nice. Huge bathroom set up here in the 240 BHLE. Big shower with the skylight. You've got a fan in here as well. Residential towel hooks, porcelain toilet, and a really nice vanity area here. Surfex countertops with no T-molds. You're protected from water here. Okay, you got the residential look medicine cabinet here with storage behind it. Toothbrush holder as well. So just a great setup in this 240 bathroom. Let's check out some of the storage you've got here in the back. You're not gonna believe all the storage you see in this 240. Incredible amount of storage. Really nice pantry setup here. Top and bottom, a ton of space here for food or any additional items you have. Great setup for storage in this 240BH. Let's check out this dining area here in the 240. I wanna point out here, you've got no carpet in the slide out. So no carpet anywhere in these units, a nice change for 2023. Really good look, pet friendly, easy to clean, um, but just a great look in general. 
like I said, six foot tall slide out box here, very comfortable. I don't even have to bend my head to step into the dinette area. So just an elevated level of comfort in these surveyors. Full size booth dinette. We put booth dinettes in all of our floor plans and I'll tell you why. They're just more comfortable uh, than U-shaped dinettes. I don't care if it's a small or a large U-shape, you cannot sit four people, especially four adults comfortably. Uh, this makes it very easy to accommodate for adults, if you wanna sit here, play cards, have dinner, whatever you wanna do, very comfortable to sit four people. You also have our easy access dinette storage. I'll tell you why I like this better than a cabinet door. It's gas strut assisted, opens very easily, but gives you that easier access to this whole storage area. If things slide to the back, it's much easier to, to reach back there and grab them versus trying to reach through a cabinet door. So. Uh, just a better setup for dinette storage, in my opinion, with your easy access storage here. And this is going to be unique to the Surveyor brand, so keep that in mind. You've got ventilated windows in the slide-out end walls as well, letting a lot of air pass through there, a lot of natural light as well. And then a huge panoramic window here um, in the slide-out, letting even more light in. But just a great setup, gives you some nice views of the campsite area. Let's check out this kitchen area. Ton of space here, a lot of counter space, big sink. You've got a big stainless steel sink here. You've got the graded sink cover as well. What's really nice about this, it's functional. When you're working in the kitchen washing dishes, you've got a place to dry those dishes um, while you're washing dishes. So a lot of times you'll have a sink cover that covers the whole sink. You don't really need that. Uh, just a half sink cover will do, but it's graded so you can dry dishes, very nice. Surfex countertops here in the kitchen, scratch stain, chip resistant, no team mold, but just a, a higher quality countertop for you in this Legend series. I'm gonna keep you protected from food particles and moisture, really nice. You've got the Furion range here, glass cover, uh, which is really nice. It's also got the nice safety feature here. When you turn it on, it's gonna turn red. Uh, so just a nice safety feature, especially if you have kids, um, but Obviously, nobody wants to touch a hot, um, a hot stove, so it keeps everybody protected there. Nice range vent here, slim Furion range vent. This is new, all new Furion appliances here for 2023. Furion microwave. You do have the standard 32 inch TV here. All TVs became standard uh, for 2023, so you have a standard 32 inch uh, TV here in the 240 on a swing arm, so you can see it from the bunk area as well as the bedroom. Uh, let's keep moving here in the kitchen. You've got a residential uh, cutting board here, which is a new feature for 2023. We're really excited about it. Gives you a functional area to, to prep food. Um, it also works as a backsplash too, looks really good, but it's food grade tested. Really nice feature there for 23. And of course you still have uh, the cup here, which is gonna hold your, your spoons, oversized uh, you know, spatulas, things of that nature. And then you've got uh, your knife block here as well, which is nice. One of my favorite features for 23, the new black glass Furion 12 volt, 10 cubic foot refrigerator. I want you guys to keep in mind as you're shopping around at comparable floor plans. Uh, this is gonna be a bigger refrigerator, bigger space than what you're gonna find out there typically. Uh, most of the floor plans that you're gonna shop this against are gonna have a, a five, six, eight cubic foot ref uh, refrigerator. Uh, you've got a 10 cubic foot uh, 12 volt, which pairs really nicely with our solar setup. We've got an 80 watt solar panel, standard equipment on every single model with a 10 amp controller. We'll talk about that a little bit more uh, before we wrap up. But just a great setup here. Tons of storage uh, that you can't see, but we've got some pull-out drawers here. Really nice branded bottle opener. And then one of my uh, favorite features for 2023 is the standard central vac system. You're gonna see this on every single floor plan. We've got some nice marketing material to show you where it's at, but very nice area to clean up in versus trying to sweep outside the entry door. You lift it up, sweep into it. It's a bag system. To replace the bag, you just take off the front and swap them out. But a really nice setup, central vac. You're gonna see it in every single surveyor floor plan. Keep in mind too, this is gonna be an exclusive feature to the surveyor group. Um, so you're not gonna see it in a lot of competing floor plans. Keep that in mind. It's a great feature. Uh, let's come to the, the front bedroom here. Great Murphy bed setup I wanna show you and a ton of storage up front. All right, let's check out this front bedroom of the 240BHLE. Look at all the storage you have up here. Oversized wardrobes to the ceiling, pull-out drawers on each side, additional pull-out drawers um, in each of the end tables here. You've also got the built-in cup holders, Surfex tops, 
and then you've got USB and power on both sides. And don't forget, you also have pull-out drawers underneath the jackknife sofa. I mean, this is an incredible amount of storage that you have in the 240 bedroom. You're not gonna believe it until you step inside. But we've got one of the best Murphy bed setups in the industry. Very easy to use, functional, high quality. Um, let me show you how easy it is. Jackknife setup, this is a very comfortable sofa. Very easy to fold down. This is a very lightweight piece here, makes it very easy to do. This latch is very functional. And one of the best things about this setup, it's a 60 by 80 residential queen bed. A lot of times in a Murphy bed setup, you're gonna have what's called an RV queen, a 74 inch bed. This is a 60 by 80. So if you're a taller person, this is gonna accommodate you. Um, but just a beautiful setup here. You've even got the cubby area, which not everybody does back behind there. Additional cup holders and even some hidden storage underneath. You've got a place to run your wires, a hole to run your wires through, and then power on both sides as well. So just a great setup here. And then of course we've got the front window in the Legend Series with the shade, uh, let natural light in if you want it, but just a, a beautiful look up front. But check out the storage. I mean, overheads, oversized wards. I can't talk enough about the storage. Just a beautiful setup. And you're gonna have overhead doors in every single floor plan for 2023. Before we wrap up here, I wanna talk about the standard solar setup. We talked about it a little bit, but you've got an 80 watt solar panel, standard equipment on the roof. It's a go power system, uh, one of the best names in solar. What I want you guys to know is you've got a 10 amp controller here that's standard equipment. It'll handle about 200 watts of solar. If you wanna go above that, all you have to do is plug and play a 30 amp controller. Uh, it's pre-wired for it, so keep that in mind. Let's step outside and we can wrap up. All right, we're wrapping up the tour of the 240BHLE. Thanks for joining me today. I wanna to remind you guys, this is a half ton towable floor plan. You can even be towed by a midsize vehicle, just over 27 feet and right over 5,000 pounds. So very versatile size. Take it anywhere, get off the grid, get away from it. Um, one of my favorite floor plans, again, double over double, residential size Murphy bed. You got the rear door in the back, just a ton of incredible features. And I wanna remind you, we've got some of the best construction in the lightweight segment, Asdale composite materials. We talked about the PVC roof, uh, laminated slide outs, side walls, rear walls, and floors, block foam insulated, uh, dedicated heat duct to the sealed underbelly. I mean, this thing has it all. Um, and again, under 28 feet, it's incredible. Um, Again, legend front end, so you can't miss it. Keep that in mind, part of our legend series. Uh, if you wanna learn more about the 240, go to our website or any other floor plan we've got out there. We've got a full lineup of true half ton towable floor plans that we offer, single axle all the way on up to your full size bath and a half bunkhouse uh, that's coming out here soon, so keep that in mind. Uh, but thanks for joining me today. Uh, again, for more info, go to our website, forestriverinc.com slash surveyor. Thanks for joining me.